change is inevitable, whether it's the air that we breathe or the picture that we just uploaded to Facebook or Flickr or whatever else. Everything we do changes something. And depending on what that thing changes, it can impact our life positively or it can affect it negatively. And most of the time, what humans will do is they will set goals. They know that once they accomplish these certain goals, that their life will be better, they will be a better person, they will ultimately possess something that they didn't have before, which is going to improve their life. As you can probably see, I've moved all the wonders of my old place of teleported to here, which is nice. Now, moving was a choice and a decision that I made based on the circumstances I had at the time. It seemed like a great idea. I was moving forward. I had more space, more room, and just progressing forward in my life. I did this with my roommate Ben, who you may remember from a payoff or other strange videos that I've done in the past, and we rent this place out together. It's a financial burden for us. It's something that we've had to bring upon ourselves, something that can be seen as a good decision or a bad decision, depending on how you see it. Now that I have moved and now that I have started this course and finished work, I find myself returning to old success books that I used to read. Every single one of these books has something useful in them, something that I can draw from, something that I can use to inspire myself each and every day. Regrettably, when I was at work, I wasn't motivated. There wasn't anything there which I really wanted to do. And because the boss of my work wasn't necessarily the best, he was slow, he was old fashioned, he didn't want to move forward in any form of his life. He just wanted to do things his way and that's it. In the end, he ended up hiring someone that was much more efficient than I was, who was able to combat the unproductive things that he did with productive things that she could do. And that's great. I'm enjoying my life a lot better now that I'm only working there one day a week. But it just annoys me that some people cannot set new goals, they cannot adapt, they cannot move forward, they cannot change. And it's because of this inability to change that I often find myself getting stressed out and tired and worked out and just overall confused. Everybody has a different reality that they want you to try and fill, a different kind of world, a different perspective or something that they would like to share with you to improve you. They all may think that it will work and will make you a better person, but in the end, all it's doing is just satisfying their own needs and their own hungers and their own wants. Someone wants me to become successful because they can't become successful themselves. Someone wants me to earn more money because they have none. Or there's just some other contributing factor which they feel will improve my life because they need it in their own. That is a negative way to view life. It's a negative way to do things. Everyone has a plan for your life. Everybody has an ultimate goal for you to fulfill. It's the same with money. If you don't have a plan for your money, then the government has a plan for your money. Your family has a plan for your money. Your friends have a plan for your money. They will all use it. They will all have it. And then ultimately you will have none left. It is the same with life. It's the same with goals. It's the same with your own time. Time is something that is precious, something that should not be wasted, something that should be held precious and something that you use all the time to the best of your ability. And regrettably, I find myself in a point where I'm always procrastinating and wasting that time. And this is the problem within my life. Where do I find the motivation? Where do I find that overall thirst to do something in my life? And I found out that it comes to the simple point of goals. If you have a goal in your life, something that will improve your life, something that you ultimately hunger for and thirst for more than anything else, not someone else's goal, but your own, one that you find to be in your life significant, something that has importance, something that you want personally, then you will strive towards that goal. Those decisions that you make when you get out of bed each morning will ultimately get you closer towards that person, towards that goal, towards that ultimate life that you will want. And that is ultimately why I would like to make this video. I want you in your own lives to make goals, to progress, to move forward, to be able to do things which are going to improve your life, not the goals of someone else, not the goals of your school, of your university, of your work, or anything else. You personally. What do you want in life? Set those goals, wake up every morning, look at them, strive towards them, get to a point where you are getting closer to that goal every single day with a growing speed, growing hunger and thirst for them. I guarantee that your life will be better. Anyway, that's the end of the rant and thanks for listening. I know it has been a while and I think I'm gonna make a video to explain that because as you can probably tell from this video, a lot has been going on.